Sanders side learning more about how investigators in West Alabama ended up arresting eight people in an underage sex sting. Now, there were no real victims involved, but your West Alabama reporter Brian Henry is live tonight from Tuscaloosa with why they say these are important cases, Brian. Well, Jonathan, this was an undercover operation targeting adults who arranged to have sex with minor children. But in this particular case, as you just mentioned, there were no children involved. The two week operation ended with the arrest of eight people. Most of them are from Tuscaloosa. They were traveling to meet a minor. Captain Phil Simpson says the suspects allegedly used social media apps, texting back and forth with what they thought were minors on the other end of the conversation. Minor. In other words, they were making arrangements with, they were chatting with uh, through dis different social media apps, texting back and forth with undercover officers posing as minor uh, children and arranging uh, to meet them for sex. A total of nine law enforcement agencies were involved in the undercover operation. The suspects ages range from 19 to 69 and face a host of charges, including making plans to meet a minor for an unlawful sex act to transmitting obscene materials. Uh, one guy wanted to stay all night with somebody that they knew uh, that they firmly believed was under the illegal age for uh, sexual contact. The undercover operation took place at all different locations from hotels to houses to parks. In this case, the people arrested express shock to putting up some resistance to being taken into custody. Although no real victims were involved in this investigation, the veteran lawman has a message for parents. You must be engaged with your child. So uh, private about what they do on uh, their device and who they're talking to, then that's when you need to that's, that's when the red flags are going up. That's when parents need to intervene at that point and find out what's going on. Now, Captain Phil Simpson says he's not sure at this point if there will be additional arrests. However, the operation will continue if it's bearing fruit. Those are his words. In West Alabama, Brian Henry, <coughs> WBRC, Fox 6 News, on your side.